50 Unix commands explain in less than 5 minutes so you don't get bored. Let's go. Who am I prints the current logged in username. ID displays the user and group identification information. CD changes the current directory to the specified location. PWD prints the path of the current working directory. LS lists the files and directories in the current location. Commonly used with the dash LA flags to print hidden files along with their permissions. MQDR creates a new directory. RMDR removes an empty directory. Touch creates a new file or updates the timestamp of an existing file. Echo prints the given text or variable to the console. Cat displays the contents of a file to the console. Head displays the beginning lines of a file. Tail displays the ending lines of a file. CB copies files or directories. Commonly used with the dash R flag to recursively copy all files. MV moves or renames files or directories. RM deletes files or directories. Commonly used with the dash R flag to recursively delete all files. Grip searches for a specific pattern or expression in files. Find searches for files and directories based on specified criteria such as a type or name. Zip compresses files into a zip archive. Unzip extracts files from a zip archive. Chmod changes the permissions of a file or directory. It allows you to modify the read, write, and execute permissions for the owner, group, and others, granting or revoking access rights. CHL changes the ownership of files or directories. It allows you to transfer ownership to a specific user or group, granting them control over the file or directory. Ping sends ICMP-based network packets to a specific IP address to check connectivity. It measures the time it takes for the packets to reach the destination and return, helping identify network connectivity issues. Fconfig displays network interface configuration information. It provides details such as IP address, subnet mask, and network interfaces on Unix-like systems. MAN displays the manual pages or documentation for a command or program. It provides detailed information, usage and examples, and explanations of command options and parameters. PS lists the currently running processes. BID of retrieves the process ID of a running program. Kill terminates the process by sending a terminate signal. It allows you to stop a running process by specifying its process ID. BKill sends a signal to terminate processes based on their name. It allows you to terminate multiple processes at once by specifying their names or patterns. Curl transfers data from or to a server using various network protocols. It supports various protocols like HTTP, FTP, and SMTP, allowing you to fetch or send data to remote servers. WGET downloads files from the internet using HTTP, HTTPS, or FTP protocols. File determines the type of a file by examining its magic header or signature. DU displays the disk usage of files and directories, commonly used with the dash H as flags for human readable output. DEF compares and displays differences between two specified files. XXD creates a hex dump or converts a file to a hex representation. Systemctl controls system services operations such as start, restart, and stop, only on system-based Linux distributions. Time measures the execution time of a command or program. Sleep suspends the execution of a script or command for a specific duration. Base64 encodes or decodes data in Base64 format. Tree displays a directory structure as a tree diagram. Cut extracts specific sections or columns from lines of a file or input. Locate locates files based on their names or patterns within the system without having to search the file system directly. TR translates or deletes characters in a file or input stream. XRs executes multiple commands at once using standard input or arguments. Watch repeatedly executes a command and displays its output in real time. Bash spawns a new bash shell or executes a specified bash script. MD5 sum calculates and displays the MD5 checksum of a file. SHA1 sum calculates and displays the SHA1 checksum of a file. SHA256 sum calculates and displays the SHA256 checksum of a file. Nano, a simple text editor for Unix-like systems. Exit terminates the current shell session or script execution. Subscribe for part 2.